Okay, so we're gonna make this. Um, I like really, really spicy food. So what we're gonna do is make this um, this paste, and it is it's two bulbs of fresh garlic. I'm gonna put that in there. Um, a quarter of a pound of serrano chilies, and a half a pound of sliced mushrooms. And then on top of all that, what we're gonna do? We're gonna get some olive oil. We're gonna get a half a cup of olive oil. And drizzle all that on top of that. And the reason I'm using a whole bunch of olive oil is because the mushrooms will soak up all the all the oil. And so we're just going to toss this. Gonna toss and toss. And then we're going to add this to the oven. On 350 degrees. Boom, let that cook. So this is the the mushrooms, the garlic, the serrano chilies, and you want to chop it up with a knife and not a food processor because what you want is you want a paste. You don't want it, and you still want some chunks in it. And it was cooking in the oven for 350 degrees for an hour. Put it in for an hour and just put it on the board to start chopping up. And just use a sharp knife just to get all the, get everything chunked up. And you want it like a paste. And I like mine a little spicier. That's why I put um, a quarter pound of serranos in there. So we're going to chop this up. And what this is used for, uh, you get some, some, some rice, some jasmine rice, some brown rice. And this is all you need to add to it because it has all the flavor. If you like spicy, and I like spicy. And this is so like a, a healthy hot sauce. There's no sugar in here. It's just what it is. So the, the other thing we're going to add in is some uh, vinegar. So... We put it here. We're going to scoop it in here. Scoop all that in there. There you go. Scoop it all in there. And then, this is the pan that we had the had it in. I've added aluminum foil in there so we can capture all the all the juices. And the best thing about this is aluminum foil cleans up quite well. So that's clean. And then I'm going to add some red wine vinegar to this. Then just going to stir this up a little bit. And I have the red wine vinegar in there, so I, I like a little tartness with my with my spark, um, spiciness. So, and that's all this is. And the best thing about it is, with this much, just depending on how much uh, you use this, just put it in the refrigerator, and you're good to go. So this is my um, my paste that I got from a friend of mine that uh, is with the uh, Boy Scouts. Um, he taught me how, how to make this. I just added uh, my the red wine vinegar in there, but this is all it is. So uh, just get this, toss it with some pasta, toss it with rice or uh, soups, stews, all that good stuff, and there you go. So here it is. The um, I guess it's like a Laotian paste. So there you go. Um, see you on my website.